Okay, so we don't need that. Let's put this to one side. And here we have the kit. So I got Cauldron of Myrrh by Ivy Delamore. This is, as we said, is square. It is 56 centimetres by 74 centimetres. Let's get into this kit because I've been waiting for this so long and I just loved it as soon as I saw it. So this is their standard tool kit. With these kits, literally the only difference between round and square is normally the tweezers. So we have our blue drill pen. We have our blue pen grip or squishing. We have a pair of tweezers. These are the pointed tweezers and they are very sharp. So you want to be careful around these so you don't. They do provide a sheath view. So whenever you're not using your tweezers, do make sure you have the sheath on them. That way you won't accidentally hurt yourself. So we have two plates of heart shaped wax. This is the wood red wax. And we get a lot of spare baggies in this one. Here are our spare baggies. So if you have hope in the pack of your drills and you don't want them to spill anywhere, then you can put them in here. Then you get the clear drill tray. There we go. So that is our square tool kit. Now it's time for the canvas. So Diamond Art Club's canvases always come in this polythene bag that helps to protect your canvas from any dust, dirt, pet fur so if you don't decide to start your kit straight away keeping it in this plastic bag will keep it nice and clean until you use it so let's get into this oh this feels heavy so i should imagine it's got a large pack of drills in this i'm loving this and i've only seen the top section oh look at that it's so pretty and the rendering is really good I'm always a bit hesitant with faces. They don't always turn out good. But this one has. So I love her little button nose. And I'm loving all the purple. So there we have Cauldron of Myrrh. Let's put our drills to one side for a moment. And have a proper look at this canvas. So start at the top. So Diamond Art Club's canvases always have the scalloped edges going all the way around your painting. And they are, if I bring this up closer, they are surged as well. The reason this is a good thing is it will stop your canvas from fraying. And then we have the Do What Makes You Sparkle slogan from Diamond Art Club. And we have their little emblem at the top. Then... We have a legend on the top left and again on our bottom right. Then in the bottom left hand corner we have a thumbnail of the image that we are about to paint which is our cauldron of myrrh. Then we have the details for this particular painting. So the name of your painting, Cauldron of Myrrh. This kit is 22 inches by 29 inches. Or if you're working in centimetres, 56 centimetres by 74. And then under that you have the licensing and trademark. So licensing from Ivy Delamore and Diamond Art Club's trademark. Then if you move to the middle of the bottom half of your canvas, we have their social media details. So you have the ability to share your works in progress on their Facebook page and Instagram page by using the hashtag Diamond Art Club to get yourself featured on their social media pages. And then finally in the bottom right hand corner you have the lifetime warranty. Your canvas comes with a lifetime warranty and free missing diamonds protection from a Diamond Art Club. So moving on from that we have our step-by-step -step instructions. So if you're diamond painter before or you're an experienced diamond painter you're not going to need this but if you've not diamond painted before or you're giving it as a gift then it will help someone who's not diamond painted before it has the nine step instructions to diamond painting from opening your kit to hanging up your finished masterpiece and you do get a discount for your next purchase then we have the small sticker that comes in your diamond painting kit you can do as it suggests on the label and use it in your logbook if you're a person that uses a logbook 
And then here is our larger copy of our legend. So we have the name of the painting, Cauldron of Myrrh by Ivy Delamore. We have the ability to put in our start date and end date, and then a larger copy of the image. This kit has in it 50 colours, and we have, let's see how many ABs we have. AB stands, if you've not done painting before and you're not used to that term. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. That's an iridescent coating that's applied onto your drills. It just makes them sparkle that little bit brighter. And with Diamond Art Club, anything under 150 will be an AB. So this kit in, it has one, two, three, four ABs. And these are all pre-cut for you, which makes labelling up a lot quicker. You can just peel them off individually and put them onto your drill storage containers. Let's have a look at this canvas closer up, zoom you in. So let's have a look at our drill quality. Not that I'm expecting any problems. So nice, clear symbols. Looks to be like there's going to be some ABs into the pot of the cauldron. So that's our drill field. Zoom you out. So our drills, let's have a look. So you, like I said, you have a mixture in this painting of your dark colours and your brights. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have two separate ones. Let's start with these. So we've got our first AB. This is 113. And again, if you've not drawn and painted it before, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. That's an iridescent coating that's applied to your drills that makes them sparkle that much brighter. Then we have our 208. So let's get onto the smaller quantities first. We have 38 for 6, 166. 666 and there's a drill that got trapped let's just look at how clean those drills are these are the DAC's newer square doors they have recently upgraded them so they're even better than they were before there's our 3843 708 498, 992, 322, 3830, which is kind of your terracotta brown, 318, medium grey, 963, pale pink, 433, chocolate brown, 355. Our second AB of this kit, which is our 134. And on this one, you can really see that AB coating. Look at all that shivering and sparkling that you can see. I love it. Then we have 30, sorry, we have 356, 898, a darker brown. 312, medium blue, 823, medium navy, 987, and then finally 336. So that they are our smaller quantity drills. Let's move on to the bigger packs. Then we have We've got 209, 
wood fire floor which is kind of like a great great purple six nine 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 fifteen nice deep fuchsia oh yeah then we have 30 sorry then we have 758 so that is our 758 3609 a nice pink 3778 718 another nice fuchsia We have eight ninety five. We have thirty six oh eight nine eighty six four fifteen seven seven nine two ten nice lavender two bags of four thirteen eight ninety and then three twenty seven. And then on to our final strip, we have our second bag of 327, 938, which is our dark brown. We have two bags of 938. We have 3837, I love this purple shade. Then we have 209. Then we have our third AB. This is 141, and you can really see that AB coating. It gives you all different shades of purple, pink, blue. It really makes your painting pop. So I love the 141 ones. And then we have 3834. Our fourth AB, 126, our nice lavender shade. 317, 310, and we have quite a few bags of 310, so let's see just how many we have. But first, I just want to show you, I'll get that show up. Let's look at how clean those drills are. So, let's get you a few. We have so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-twenty-four, thirty-twenty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-twenty-four, thirty-twenty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, you got no tabs, no knobbly bits, no dimples. Nice clean drills, which I love. So then we have 37.99, which is our medium grey. And we have two bags of that medium shade of grey. And then our final colour for this kit is 3371, which is a really dark brown, almost verging on black. And we have, let's have a look. We have one, two, three, and four. So we have four packs of 371. And now I'm going to get them back into the bag. Now our, our drills are back into their bag. So let's have a look at where those ABs are going to go, shall we? 
So we have some number fours here and the tip of her hat. We have some babies in her eyes, in the whites of her eyes. And same with the cat. We have some number four here, a little patch of it, and then a little patch here. A lot of four is in the part of the cauldron. And uh, two, number two AB is in the cauldron as well. So we have two different ABs in here. We've got the number one and number two. Do we have it anywhere else? So this is Cauldron of Myrrh. I just love this painting. I At this moment, unless I get another kit in that I absolutely love, this is the kit that I'm planning on doing after my current work in progress. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at this kit as much as I've enjoyed showing it to you. So if you've enjoyed this video, please do give this video a like. And if you would like to see more content like this, then please do subscribe to the channel. You can do that down here. And if you are already subscribed to the ch channel, thank you very, very much. But please do make sure you have your notifications bell turned on. That way you will get a notification of when I upload another video. So again, with that said, thank you for joining me today. I've enjoyed having you with me and I hope to see you, all of you in the next one. Bye.